everybody, this is Ben Christensen. Um, I have been able to perform with a few different small circuses, including time with the uh, Circus Hall of Fame at the Indiana State Fair. And uh, in 2013, I was named the World Clown Association Master Clown. Today, I'm going to teach you how to do this. The first step, of course, to do this comedy bit is you have to be able to balance a chair on your face. Um, the easiest way to do it, I think, is to balance it on your chin. Although you can fool around with balancing it on your nose or on your forehead, too, you can figure it out. Um, now, we're going to take a quick little look as we learn how to balance um, at a clip from the Auxiliary Props DVD. And this is a DVD I was involved with. Take a look at this, it'll show you how to learn how to balance a chair on your chin. Now I'm about to make balancing seem a lot easier than it actually is. Uh, the trick is to watch the top. If you keep the bottom underneath the top, the object will stay balanced, whether that's on your chin, on your nose, on your forehead, on your hand, on your foot, whatever it is. Um, the difference is the perspective. When it's on my head, I often have to tilt it back a little bit further than I think I would need to. Um, so we're going to see here with the chair, the weight is distributed just a little bit differently. And so I, I'm trying to find like a straight line that I can visualize and try to keep that line straight up and down. So like here you can see the bottom of the chair to the front legs, kind of a straight line, that's what I watch. And there, tilt my head forward, chair hits me in the head, and it's funny. Take the chair, first goes up, I'm going to balance the back of the chair here on my chin. When I get it up there, I'm going to tilt my head forward, allowing the chair to slip off my chin chair is going to come down both hands up to brace for the impact so that we're not taking the full weight of the chair on the top of my head. Oof. And the rest from there is acting in a good pratfall. Uh, that's it.